Yeah, act like you're talking about I feel like I the started song. this whole crazy shindig. Shit's about to go down in this next two months, that's all I gotta say. And it's all starting with this Diet Pepsi. <laughs> and a stolen backpack, and it's his fault. That'll be the name of the documentary. It all started with this Diet Pepsi. <laughs> so we're trying to find... So we went out to Lake Kuyamaka, Julian, Ramona area to try to get this... Um, try to find these areas that were both um, lush forest and the burn down. Yeah, we're looking for a burn down forest. And this is going to be the forest that Christopher goes into and he plays his fiddle and it turns lush and we'll be using a different forest for that. But um, as you know, the fire burned a lot of the forest around here so hopefully we can find some really good spots for that. Uh, half year is a mill model, I get camera shy, man. Mike here is our, uh, our tour guide. And yeah. location spot. So Location scouting is always a fun time. Um, well, I was there on a very exciting first location scouting and um, met some interesting people. My what? grandpa died five times. He died five times. How do you die five times? Well, he was a firefighter fighting a fire. Uh -huh. A burning tree fell, him, fell, hit him on the head, killed him. The paramedics brought him back to life. He went into surgery, died on the operating table. They call him dead. He came back to life. They started surgery again. He died again. They called him dead again. <laughs> and he's still alive. <laughs> Mike Sexton, look for the documentary in five years. <laughs> it was cool, you know, going to all these places and it really kind of brings the story to life. I felt in, especially going to Ramona and there was just, everything was dead and it was kind of what we were looking for. But I don't think anything really, I, I couldn't really imagine that the, the the movie being shot at these Let's places into, so far. Let's look into possibly looking at um uh call it? like an actual area under like we call it the Julian National Park. Oh, we and should because go we could get it would be easier for, uh, for us to park there. Yeah. We and, should uh, go to the Julian like real estate place or something somewhere where they really know like the town. Yeah. And Can they we know everything. That? We should do that now. Let's do that. Let's now. go! <laughs> going to Mike's property right now. Let's look at some burnt down forest and right some now you guys nice looking forest. Wow, yeah, that's kind of like really pretty. Um, talk about a little bit about the location scouting portion so far the, from what you've done. So far, it's been kind of rough. Uh, we're still looking for a forest and a couple other locations. We did, however, uh, come across a chapel in, um, over in Balboa Park. We've talked to them. That might also second as the church exterior, and uh, we've been successful so far, I think. We are still working on that, but we're still kind of in that location phase. It's, it's rough because we have to drive out there and uh, talk to the people, and it's, you know, you can only, you can only do so much in a day and when you're trying to do a lot of things at once, it, it gets hard, but we're, I think we're coming along with it uh, well. Would it be at night? Just, or? Kind of a, yeah. Uh, it takes a lot of time. You, you gotta think about the street lights, too. Shit. Okay. If you shoot at night. Uh, that's the most One, two. Okay, it'd be only. Yeah, Number Two. Number two. I think that's the official name. All right, we got power lines in the way. We have retarded trees in front of it. <laughs> Let's just make it a, a modern piece. It's <laughs> totally changed everything. We have these lights that we would have to like physically take a ladder and like take those off. All we, okay, at night, we need to make sure we turn the lights off, and we can cover them up so that we, you know, don't see them. It's these trees! That one's going to be used. I hate these trees! I mean, going out there was, was nice. We get to see 
because I wrote part of the script to involve the burn down forest San Diego's burned down a year ago. So much on a project that has had so much put into it already and we still have like four weeks before we shoot. Um, 